Hello, 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 beautiful people. Our cozy cottage here, Queen Fauna, your host. How's everybody doing today? I am home, chilling. It is Sunday evening. Had a beautiful, beautiful day today. A service, then came home and um, looked at um, services on Zoom from my headquarters and then looked at services from a St. Lucia um, church in St. Lucia. And our pastor is there teaching to the saints over there and, and guests and visitors who wants to um, change their life. And um, it's been beautiful over there. He's been over there since um, Saturday. Um, so we watch, I watched Saturday service, Saturday night evening, late evening service there um, on um, YouTube. Um, St. Lucia and then they had the morning service on YouTube in St. Lucia so it was so I just been getting all kinds of great word of God um, all day so it's been um, beautiful it's been beautiful 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 but I just want to get on here and say hello it's been a, a few seconds since I've been on here um, I'm trying to at least get on here once out of the week now <laughs> and so I can post different videos because I do have some things going on and uh, we'll be doing some things um, so I'm hoping soon to um, clean off wash off my my porch and stain it which i'm gonna do a video tape for that because pollen season is getting close getting close to being over thank you jesus <laughs> it's getting close because y'all mm, po that pollen is really bad especially when this season is in is thick and it's on everything so i try to stay inside most of the time um and it's all over your car and all that craziness. So, um, but we know that the rain, God brings the rain um, throughout the time pollen season here to help wash it away. So that's what it's been doing quite a bit in the last couple of weeks. We've been getting a lot of rain, which has been great uh, because it's been um, taken away some of the pollen so it's not as thick it's still here but it's not as bad so we're grateful and thankful for that but anyway as soon as it is over I'm gonna do my porch and I can't wait because I was gonna do it last year but I um, decided not to do it um, um, well I wanted to do it but I kind of procrastinated because I was doing so much. I had a busy schedule. I had a lot on my plate. I'm going to just put it that way. I had a lot on my plate. And I just got tired. And I didn't feel like doing it. And But now, definitely, definitely got to get it done this year because it's, my push has faded just a little. And um, I like it nice and tight, you know. Um in which I um, I want to show you guys I show you guys I'm not going to tell you the stain that I have on my porch I love this stain um, it kind of matches my house my home so I can't wait to do that and I'm doing some other things oh hey guys I put up my um, my new mailbox um, I had a I had a black mailbox. It's, it's like the hard plastic one because I find that to be um, better to get the hard plastic type mailbox because um, it it holds up better. 
through the weather and all of that. And plus, during the winter, guys, the the state trucks that come through, like if it, we get snow and stuff, they come scraping, scraping the roads and everything. And they don't care. They will, from where our mailboxes is kind of close to the road. you know. And that's why I don't understand why we have to have our mailboxes a certain type of length from the road and i think it's really too close because during the winter if it snows or something you know that them plows come through my boss has been knocked <laughs> knocked down so many times but the hard plastic type of mailbox um it's been holding it up but from where it's been hit so much it broke the last time they hit it it broke the door the door handle that pulls the door open and it broke one side of it so I kind of dragged all last year because I was gonna do it last year but I didn't but it's been held out sometimes I get up in the morning and go to work I see my door hanging open and I go and close it and you know I'm surprised that the male people ain't said nothing but it, they didn't because they probably knew what happened, you know. And you're talking about dealing with the state, you know. Which the state is supposed to reimburse me, but they weren't going to reimburse me until I buy a new bail box and I send them the receipt. <laughs> what if I didn't have the money, you know, but they don't care. So, I bought, I finally bought another one. And actually, I got a white mailbox this time. And, um. It's nice, very nice looking, but it's the same type of mailbox, but it's just white. The first one was black, and it's white this time. And um, I actually put it together. I, I started to videotape it, but I didn't, you know. I put it together kind of quick, but I will show you. I do a videotape, and I show you the actual mailbox. Because I will show you, because I have to so, um, screw uh, the screws on the on the um i would say kind of like the leg part of the mailbox that should slide down on the post um the wooden post and it's two screws on each side you you screw in in, in the leg part of the mailbox into the wood to keep it sturdier so i gotta do that and um i thought i had um a power tool that you know screws in nails and, and unscrew them but I do but it was electric oh man I was so mad I was like what I thought I had a battery operated one so what I did which I'm gonna buy buy one um I'm I'm gonna buy a nice um, heavy duty one with battery out paper but right now and I actually went and purchased um, um, I, I purchased a smaller one which will work it will it, it will do a lot of jobs you know and it wasn't that much and I purchased some nail bits with it I, let me show you let me show you I'm gonna show you how it looks okay I'm back let me show you my nail gun. It's smaller, but it's going to work with plenty of jobs around the house. I'm going to get a bigger one, but this is fine. This is um, battery operated. It's a Black & Decker. This is so nice. Look, it even got a light, guys. <laughs> and this is nice. And I just, I charged it up today. It has a as the charger I charge it up today so now I can just take it like this and go outside go to the mailbox and and screw in the nails that I have um, and then I bought some black and decker nail bits and it's all different sizes and but I think I got some nail bits because when I um, basically when I um, had my home had um, my home built um, I bought like a big, big, uh, toolbox thing with a whole bunch of tools and stuff, which, um, it's good to purchase for your home. When you have a home, you know, they tell you the different tools to have for, for your home and stuff. But, um, 
it wasn't that expensive, so I, I got that anyway. So, but I do videotape when I um, screw in the nails in my mailbox and show you my mailbox. It's very nice looking. It looks good. Um, but I'm doing a little bit things at a time, and I'm still spring cleaning my home. Um, so I'm gonna be doing um, um. I'm gonna be um, doing very deep cleaning. I'm doing some deep cleaning in my in every room, which I've already done in my bathrooms, which I told y'all in the last video. I did the last two bathrooms, but I haven't done any other rooms yet because I got busy doing some other things. But I'm gonna get back on it this week. So Lord willing, starting tomorrow, I'm gonna get in my bedroom here. Um, and I'm going to deep clean that. Um, I'm sorry. I have, um, I have my TV on. <laughs> That's what you probably hear. And, um, one of my favorite shows is on with Queen Latifah, um, The Equalizer. She is, um, she's a bad mama. <laughs> That's my girl. I love this show. But, um, I think I might put this on pause and finish watching this because it's almost over because it's really good. It's a lot going on. I have no idea why I turned on the video at this time while this was on. <laughs> so, give me a second. I'll be back because what I want to do is read you another chapter or two of the little woman please forgive me for my last read i was so relaxed and tired and i shouldn't have read and i was kind of all over the place but i'm gonna read the next two chapters so give me a second so i'll finish watching the equalizer with queen latina